When you got nothing better to do, it's time to get hanging with the hers. Okay. All right, so we're making vegan chocolate chip cookies, uh, and we're actually doing a lot of improv on this recipe that we found on about.com because we don't have a lot of the ingredients, so there's lots of substitutions made. Uh, unsweetened cocoa powder, we're short on it. Uh, there was two cups of flour, that was all right. Less than two-thirds cup unsweetened cocoa powder, since we were short on it. Uh, one teaspoon baking soda. Instead baking of baking soda. soda, we're doing baking powder. And half a teaspoon. Half a teaspoon of salt. Of salt. Oh, no, hummed no. it a lot. We had that. We didn't have salt. You said salt. Did I not say it? No. Go ahead and add it. <laughs> one quarter, one and one quarter cup of sugar. We had less than a cup of sugar, so we're going to use. We're going to throw in. Uh, brown sugar to, f to make up the rest. Uh, instead, uh, we got four teaspoons of ground flax seeds. Instead of flax seeds, we're throwing in chia seeds. And they're not ground. Yeah, don't forget that. Uh, I'm not bother grinding them. Well, you got a mortar and pestle, so you could if you wanted to. You want to do it? No. There you go. <laughs> I'm just as lazy as you are. All right, so half a cup of non-dairy milk like soy or almond. We'll get that thrown in. Uh, it looks like she's actually... She's using almond right now. And then coming so we're up. making it in our new, new wave. Yes. Oven, oven. Friend got us a new wave oven today. So it not only got used for dinner, it's getting used for dessert the same night that it arrived. So uh, outside of all that, um, wrapping it up, we're looking at about two teaspoons of vanilla extract. And because we don't have chocolate chips or chunks, we're doing without. So, what else? Did you do two-thirds cup vegetable oil? And I haven't done the wet. Yeah, yet. we haven't done the wet ingredients yet. So it's like. Needs to sit aside for a bit before I can, so it can get gloopy. Now, is that gloopy going to affect the actual process? Did it affect dinner? <laughs> you, what you put chia seeds in dinner tonight? Yeah. Yeah, we had meat. We had meatloaf, and it wasn't all slimy, so that's good. Vegan meatloaf with TVP. Yeah, it's one thing with chia seeds is they, it's, it's almost like in a, the, the asparagus slime. To me, what? it was. Yeah, asparagus we, has slime. or or a gelatin type of texture. Asparagus. Am I, am I not? I'm thinking of okra. Never mind. It's gonna say. Okra slime. Sorry. Well, we got to get it right. Come on. Alright, that's going to set aside for a bit. Well, why don't you finish everything else while you're waiting for it? Well, all I'm basically doing right now is just stirring the dry ingredients. Breaking, because um, we use brown sugar, so I've got to break up the, the brown sugar. It's not as loose, but living out here in the desert, we don't have it where it's, we have to worry about it completely hardening up. Well, I guess, yeah, because all the moisture's out. But it's actually been quite good since we've been out here, so. Because uh -huh. usually I've got it in a container, like when we were living, when we were actually living in a brick and mortar home and not the motor home, I had it with a, in a container with a piece of bread on it. Because if you put a piece of bread on, over the, in the container with the, with the brown sugar, it keeps it nice. Well, we definitely have been living the adventurous lifestyle of RV folk. Yes, and you guys RV full timers. Our, our brand new vlog. What it's like living in an RV. Uh, it wasn't. Like it, one position, you got a blog position. right now. I wouldn't call it a vlog yet until this actually gets uploaded. Well, yes, this is our and then new you, vlog. And then you have to actually start doing uh, doing uh, videos on a regular basis in order for it to be an actual vlog. Yes. Otherwise, it's just a random video on a blog. No, this is going to become a vlog. I'm telling you. So you're going to start. You're going to become the the, the new Shay Carl, but with the uh, but well, other uh, other what, female what's gender. His wife? What's his wife? Katie Lett. Yeah. Whatever. I don't know. 
Because I don't think I could be Shay Carl, seriously. Well, I don't think you could be Katie Lett either because she's more dainty and soft spoken, whereas you're more in your keep face. Going. You're in your face like keep Shay going. Carl. I'll keep going. Keep going, dude. I don't have a problem. <laughs> It's like, yes, you are feminine, but you're more in your face like Shea Carl. Yes. I'm a butch bitch. That's what I am. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have gone that far. Wait, as long as you're saying there. it about yourself, <laughs> you were I'm, out of, I'm out of hot water. I wasn't going there. You're in deep hot water, mister. Uh, why would I be? You said it about yourself. Yeah, 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 whatever. Uh-huh. Well, you started going there, so... Okay, this is... I did not. Okay, come over here. Come over here with the camera so you can... It's one of your favorite things, making assumptions. Jeez. Why are we looking... Because they... So they can see how gloopy it is. See? Now yeah, we can like go... It's like porridge, right? Yeah, now we can go into the... They didn't sit that long. And for those of you that are Americans, porridge is also considered oatmeal. <laughs> Because I had no idea what porridge was when we first got together. Yeah, but it's gloopy now. I've heard of porridge and, and uh, what was it, uh, gold, uh, Goldilocks and all that jazz. Okay, it's gloopy now. Yes, I know it's gloopy Okay, so now. this is to replace egg in the... Is that what it was meant for? Yes, this is to replace egg. When you use the it... The seeds yes. that was originally? Yes, this is to replace egg. Uh, now, if you want, you can make it... So um, would that vague, that the vague, would that be, act as a replacer if you wanted to use it instead of the seeds? I don't, I've never used vague, but I would, I would think so. You can use uh, applesauce. You can use tofu, um, but this is a, this is a, this is to replace the egg. Okay, so where we want to get that? See, and then I, you got a nice mix here, which is a nice, a nice color. All nicely mixed in. Okay. And you added the brown sugar to make up for the white, right? Yep. Okay, so now we're... Anything else you missed, like vanilla extract? Yep. How much? Two teaspoons? Okay, grab that. <laughs> my chest up. Okay. Might barely have that much to cover it, huh? <laughs> Might, yeah. I'm using a half teaspoon, so... Okay, what else? Okay. Two third a cup oil. Yep, two third cup oil. Okay. Vegetable oil. Big in here. Uh -huh. oh. Just fill a cup two thirds of the way. Anything else? Yeah, half cup non-dairy milk. Did you you already did that though, right? Yeah, with the with the flat. So we got the flour, we got the cocoa powder, baking soda, teaspoon, vegetable oil, sugar, seeds, milk, vanilla extract, non-dairy chocolate chips or chunks. We didn't put those in, so yeah, just mix it together and you should be good to go. Brownish, looking like something chocolatey. Okay, this doesn't feel right. I'm adding more milk. Yeah. <laughs> uh, chia seeds are probably soaking up a lot of the fluid. If yep. Or they already soaked up a lot of the fluid, I should say. Since you let them sit. So 
so we'll just keep adding the milk until we get it all ready to go. Ball it up, put it on the oven, in the oven. The new wave. Maybe we'll take some pictures before they go in or as they're in and then after they're done and wrap this puppy up. So you're just scooping them out, you're not actually forming them or anything? Nope. It's like drop cookies. We'll see how it does because I didn't grease it either. Setting it on 10, 12 minutes on high power. Say what? It's starting to smell really good. Ah. You can't smell them? Of course I can. I figured that out minutes ago. <laughs> minutes? Yeah. Like 12 minutes because they've been going for about 12 minutes. Wow, they've been smelling good for about half that time. I think it was starting to smell good almost immediately putting on weight just from smelling it but hey it's got chia seeds so it's healthy Ooh. yummy <coughs> dark <coughs> what was that nothing when does it bing when does it ping? I know you're hungry, but jeez. Ping! I know you want dessert, but gosh dang it. Ping! It didn't ping. <laughs> Damn it! Alright, well that was a fail. Okay. <clears throat> Don't touch that, it's very hot. You see, and then you can use this new wave grill as a cooling rack. New wave, the answer to everything. And you're looking to work for them now? They can chuck me a few shekels, I don't mind. They can send us some of those new wave cooktops, right? Yes, because my Faberware cooktop doesn't just conduct heat when it hits the conducting heat pan thingy majiggy things. So the element gets hot, not just the pot, right? Exactly, and this gets very hot, and I have cats, and they jump on here. Yeah, we don't need them burning their paws. So New Wave, please, be kind. <laughs> send me something so I can try out, because your New Wave oven We don't want them to just send us any something. We want them to send us the cooktops. Yes. The induction cooktops. Induction cooktops, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no sneaking mm. a bite until they're 
cool. Mmm, it's good. Next step, we eat. As I cook some more. Oh, you're gonna cook some more, huh? Well. I don't think these people need to be wasting their time with all of that, so we're just gonna say our salutations right now. Yummy! Try it! Mmm! <laughs> Dork. <laughs> Now don't you forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and share it all with your friends. Till next time, hanging with the herds.